What is up everybody, Josh here again, and today we have a new Icarus video for you. Today we're going to be showing you where to find all 53 fish in Icarus on Styx and Olympus, and what lures they like, and also some fishing tips. Down below we're going to have some chapters linked where you can find a specific fish you're looking for, so don't forget to use that, and also please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. This took well over 40 hours, guys, to put together. Tons of research. It took about a week and a half for us to actually get this out to you. So just a real quick refresher on the basics of fishing. This is a basic spawn blocker or basic animal deterrent. These are really advised whenever you go to fishing. They will pretty much make everything leave you alone whenever you're fishing. So if you put that, you don't have to watch your back. I've never had an issue unless you have a body actually laying down at your feet. This is a tackle box, and these are actually very, very useful when you're going to go capture fish, especially if you're wanting to display them. For example, if we caught a fish and put it in this slot right here, the fish will never expire. And you can also keep three different lures as well in a tackle box, which will put extra space in your inventory. And of course, just a fishing rod. You'll put the fishing rod in your inventory, hit that button, and then you can left click and throw out. Left click reels in the lure just a little bit and right click retracts it completely. And you can also move around a little bit while you're fishing as well. It will move with you. And of course, in tier two, the basic fishing bench, this is where you craft all those items. And you have to be at least level 10 to have the basic fishing bench and unlock fishing. Also keep in mind there are fishing perks if you decide to go into them, though they aren't necessary to get every fish in the game. Most of them do just kind of increase the rarity, size, whatnot. So if you're looking for really large fish, you might be advised to go with a character that has fishing perks. If not, you might get a decent size one eventually. We're not going to go into the fishing perks. You could take a look at them at any time you want by going to talents and seeing if you would like those. So we're going to go ahead and just hold left click and throw out our fishing line. We're gonna wait for a little while and you'll see your little lure right there in the water. Once that turns yellow, like that, now you have your fish. And what you need to do is keep the little white box by left clicking. If you hold left click, it goes right. If you let go of left click, it goes to the left. And now you have a fish. Left click it to bring it into your inventory even though it already is. And in your inventory, you'll see you now have your fish. Of course, you can do whatever you want with that fish. Display it, cook it up, whatever you need to do. Usually, I just take mine and put them in the tackle box for later. As you can see, will not spoil. Now, in this video, you're also going to see many different types of lures that we use or suggest using for the fish. All you have to do is hold R to select that lure and put it on your fishing pole. And sometimes it does take a while for you to catch the fish that you really want. For example, we don't need a spotted snapper, so we're just going to right click, to let him go. Some of the two to three percent fish do take a very long time to catch. Also in the workshop, there is an item available called the FISH, and this is basically a fish finder, guys. When you get close to a body of water, it will calibrate and show you a visual representation of what the fish look like. So there's five fish that can be caught in this zone and you see the percentage of chance to catch that fish as well. Also, when you move away from that biome and move to another biome, it'll reset while you have it in your hand, like so. Yeah, I went up and aggroed him. That was kind of my fault. He was teetering on the edge of my uh, thing here, but yeah, he, he got mad. And we're going to catch our very first fish here. And bring it back home. So up first we have the Azure Diano, and this is a rare freshwater fish. On Olympus, you will be able to find it anywhere in the Arctic. Usually just down in this cave has water. So you should be able to find it down there if you're looking there. I wouldn't suggest the Arctic, but you could you can search there. You could do all the forest biome down here. You can also do these three lakes right here at M9, N10, and the bottom left corner of 08 here. Anywhere in the southern glacier and in the Arkwood outpost. 
And on sticks, you can find it here in this area called the Grove, just any water source in those areas. When we mention a whole biome, that just basically means if you find a water source, whether it be a cave or whatnot, you could try to use that water source to find it. We also have this area right here in the Great River, this lake at L4, and in the south of the Great River down here at E14, you can and top of E15 here. You can also find it there as well. And this is the fish guide or fish entry for it. You'll see it does have a preference of dog tag lures, rubber lures, poison sack lures, and white jelly lures. Our next fish is the banded discus, and it is a rare freshwater fish. And this fish is only found in one place and on one map, Olympus. It is found down here in the B5 to B6 area of the Riverlands. So just in the south area here of the Riverlands where these lakes are. Uh, you may be able to catch them in the rivers as well, but I'm not 100% sure on that. And the banded discus is only in Olympus, fresh water, and it likes dog tag lures, rubber, poison, and white jelly lures. Next up, we have the banded dory, and it is a rare saltwater fish. And this fish is also only caught in Olympus. You can find it in the canyons region, which is this top right biome here. The desert region, most likely probably here. And in the central area of the canyon, so in these little ponds right here. Also, a good thing to keep in mind is that most saltwater fish are caught in desert biomes, and most freshwater fish are caught in Arctic and forest type biomes. And the favorite lures of the banded dory is dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly. Here is the banded jack, which is a freshwater common fish. The banded jack is only located in two places in Icarus. You will find it in the top left corner of B3 here at this little pond. And also in the Arkwood Outpost. And it has two favorite lures. It is the fiber lure and the rotten meat lure. Next up we have the black diamond discus. And it is a freshwater rare fish. The black diamond discus can pretty much be found anywhere in the Riverlands biome and in the south portion of the biome as well. And also on the Ice Home and Holdfast outposts. And its favorite lure is the dog tag, rubber, poison, and jelly. White jelly. Next up we have the Coral Diano, and it is a rare freshwater fish. On Olympus, you can find it here in this lake right here at the bottom of G14 in the forest biome and also the ice home outpost and in the sticks biome you can find them in the enclosed wood area here around I12 J12 you can find them around ring lake which is what this biome is called here you can also catch them around the ring lake biome here in this area this is called the ring lake crater and if you're finding caves with water, you can catch it over in this biome as well. And this fish's favorite lures are the dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly. This beautiful fish is called the Coral Dorado, and it is a saltwater rare fish. This fish is only caught on sticks, and it is in the Oasis biome, which is around in this area before the ledge here. And all this right here is Oasis. It can be caught in all the bodies of water in Oasis as well. But I did have the best luck, it seemed like, in maybe the river areas rather than the ponds. But it may have been just a coincidence. And this fish's favorite lures are dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly. Next up we have the coral rip jaw, which is a saltwater common fish. And this fish is also only found on sticks. It is located in this area right here. This full biome is one of the areas it's located called Dry Ridge. And in the west part of the biome right here in these lakes. So try to search in these lakes and you'll find this fish. And its favorite lures are the fiber lure and the rotten meat lure. 
This fish is the Crimson Darter, and it is a saltwater uncommon fish. And the only place that you can find this is on sticks and in the oasis. And in these two ponds right here, I didn't check the cave right here at top of N13. Very well could include that as well, but it could be a different biome as well. But in this area right here is where you can find it on sticks. The Crimson Darter has several lures it likes. The Refined, Iron, Advanced, Gorse, Cured, Reed, Yeast, and Blue Reed lures. So next we have the Crimson Dory, which is a saltwater rare fish. The only places I've been able to find this fish was on Olympus, here in the bottom right of K7, top right of K8 and the bottom right of J2, right here in this pond, over here in the canyons region. It does say that there are sticks locations, so I would guess just to check in the desert biomes as saltwater fish are caught there. I was not able to find it on sticks. Its favorite lures are the dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly. And you can see it says Olympus and sticks here. I'm not sure if that's a typo or not, but I didn't see it in sticks. Next, we have the Crimson Piranha, and it is a saltwater common fish. On Olympus, this fish can be caught in the canyons biome, and that counts for every lake as well. And on sticks, can only be found in Oasis around M12 and N13, right here. And you can use the fiber lure and the rotten meat lure to catch this fish. Next up is the Crimson Snapper, and this is a freshwater fish that is common. On Olympus, you can find it in this bottom lake right here in the forest biome at G14, and on the Holdfast Outpost. On Styx, there are several other locations you can find it. You can pretty much find it in all four, or sorry, five of the snow biomes. Alpine Valley up here, the Ice Flats up in here, the Wall in this area right here, Snowy Plateau, and Frozen Traverse. You can also find this fish in the enclosed wood biome right here in this lake at J12, and in the Grove area around F12 and G12 right here. You can also find it in the Great River area up north here at L4, L3 in this pond. And if you find water over here in the verdant terraces as well, at A5B5 down to A7B7. And the Crimson Snapper's favorite lures are the fiber lure and rotten meat lure. Next up we have the Crimson Triggerfish, and this fish is an uncommon saltwater fish. And this fish can actually only be found on sticks in this location right here in the Dry Ridge area and these lakes. So fish the dry ridge area over here in the west part and over here on the east part and you should find this fish. And this fish has several of the lures that it likes. It likes the refined iron, advanced iron, gores, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and the blue reed lures. Next up we have the crimson race and it is a uncommon saltwater fish. This fish is commonly found in this whole area right here. Any body of water or cave that you fish in, it should be able to find it in the oasis here and also in the Dusty Barrens. Well, you should be able to find it in this biome. Just another one to note that this one does say it actually spawns in Olympus, but I have not found where it spawns. But the lures it likes is the refined iron, advanced iron, gores, cured, reed, yeast, and blue. Next up, we have the Crystal Discus, and this is a freshwater rare fish. And this fish can be found anywhere in the Riverlands, and I actually found mine up here at B3, up here at that one pond in the north of the Riverlands as well. That's where I found mine. And this fish's favorite lures are going to be the Dog Tag, Rubber, Poison, and White Jelly. Next up, we have the Crystal Piranha, and this is a saltwater common fish. On Olympus, you can find the Crystal Piranha in these lakes right here, bottom of J2 up north. You can also find it in the M4 pond 
in around K45 here in this area, these ponds. And this one right here at K7, K8. And you can actually find it on sticks as well in these two ponds right here. Down in the oasis at M12 and at N13. And the Crystal Piranha's favorite lures are the Fiber and Rotten Meat Lure. Next up we have the Crystal Race and it is actually a saltwater uncommon fish. Now on Olympus you're only finding this in one location and that's down here in the desert at A13 and B13 right here. And same thing with sticks only on two ponds at the M12 and N13 ponds right here. It takes pretty much every lure, refined, iron, advanced, gores, cured, reed, yeast, and blue reed lures. Next up we have the electric wraith, and this is the rarest fish that you can catch in Olympus at about a 3% catch chance. This is a unique fish, the only one that's currently in the game at this moment on Olympus. There's only three places where you can find this fish, and that's at G14, right here at this pond. You can also find this fish over here at O11, right here in this little tiny pond. And then also, there is that pond up in the Riverlands, up north, around B3. You can find it here as well. And be very patient when trying to catch that one. Now, the Electric Wraith is one of them fish that we don't have a lure for because it's actually a unique class and not rare. I like the White Jelly Lure to try to catch this thing, and it does take a very long time to do so, so be, like I said, be patient with that. I would use a lure that gets rare fish. That way you could get the Electric Wraith. I usually use those, and it seems like it worked quite effectively, so... Next, we have the Ember Dorado, and this little fish right here is caught only on sticks, actually. It is a rare saltwater fish. And the only place I've been able to find this on sticks is over in this pond right here. I don't know about this one 100%, but I did find mine over in this pond. It's over here at C4D4, C5D5, that pond right there in the Dry Ridge area. And this fish loves the dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly lures. We have the Ember Jack, which is a freshwater common fish. There he is. And you can actually only catch this one in the Riverlands on Olympus. And you can catch it around these ponds down here, the pond up here. You can also catch it on Holdfast Outpost. And this fish actually really likes the fiber lure and the rotten meat lure. We have the ember snapper, and this is a freshwater common fish. On Olympus, the only places you can catch this is up in these top lakes right here. Kind of in the east, northeast part of the biome. There's one right here at the very entrance going into the desert at M9, N10 and at the bottom left of 08 there. You can also get it in the Ice Home Outpost. And on sticks, the only place you can find it is in the Grove, right up here at F2, top left of G2. Ring Lake, which is these ponds right here, and this as well, I do believe. You can also find it pretty much anywhere in the river area, right in the middle, the very large Great River area. And then also at the very top right of G7, that pond right here, and the little pond right here, or kind of medium-sized pond, and I7, J7 right here, right in the dead smack middle of the map. And this fish actually adores fiber and rotten meat lures. This guy is the Ember Trout, and he is a freshwater uncommon fish. In Olympus, you can catch it in the south portion here of the Riverlands, and also on Holdfast Outpost. And over here on Sticks, you're going to find it over here in the Ring Lake and Reed Link Crater areas right here. So all this whole biome right here, you'll also find it in all this biome right here. Just fish down here at this lake at J12. This is the enclosed wood biome. If you're over here in the verdant terraces, you'll find in caves the ember trout. The ember trout likes the refined iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, 
reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. So this is the Ember Race, and it is a saltwater uncommon fish. And this fish can only be caught on Olympus. You can catch it here at the bottom right of J2, this lake all the way up northwest. Also catch it here at M4. I believe I caught one here at K4 and around these ponds right here. K4 and the bottom right at K5 there. I think of the one I actually caught and kept was down here at K7. So these poles of water right here is where you're looking to catch them. And this fish really likes refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. It does also say that it does it is caught on sticks, but I have not been able to find it on sticks yet. This fish is the Emerald Diano, and it is a freshwater rare fish. Now, you can find it over here at 0708, this great crater right here. You can fish this fish here, only on sticks, by the way. You can also find it here at J7, this pond or lake right here, and at, and at G7 right here and pretty much anywhere else in the Great River. Also, let it be noted, it does state it is an Olympus, but I never found one at any of the ponds that fished. The favorite lures are dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly. The Emerald Dorado is this fish. It is a saltwater rare fish. And I've only found this fish on sticks. I found them in these ponds right here at M12, N13 in the Oasis. I think you can also find it pretty much anywhere in the Oasis. And I think also in any of the caves in the Dusty Barrens. This fish's favorite lures are the dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly lure. This guy right here is the Emerald Jack and he has a freshwater common fish. The Emerald Jack can only be located down here at B6 and B5 here in the south part of the Riverlands. And you can also find it on the Ice Home Outpost. And the Emerald Jack's favorite lures are going to be the Fiber and Rotten Meat Lures. This is the Emerald Snapper and it is a freshwater common fish. On sticks, you can find this on Frozen Traverse if you find a source of water to fish it from. You can also find it up here in a grove around F2. All the other biomes, the ice flats, Alpine Valley, and Snowy Plateau, and the wall, all those places you can find it if you can find a source of water. And I've actually caught a few down here at E14 in the bottom of the Great River. This fish's favorite lures are the fiber and rotten meat lures. This next fish is the rarest fish in Icarus. According to the fish finder, it is a 2% catch rate. And it is a saltwater unique fish, the only saltwater unique. This fish can only be caught on sticks. And I've only caught it in three different locations. I caught it at Dry Ridge West, down here at M12 and N13, down in these ponds. I do believe I caught it there. I'm not sure about this one down here, L L14, but it may be down there as well. And the ghostly tang, as it says, sticks. There's no other effective lures. Just use the best rare lures you have to catch this fish, and that's how I caught mine. This fish is the Neon Dorado. And it is a rare saltwater fish. I only found this fish on sticks and around this pond right here at C4 and D5. Around this pond right here. I don't know. I think you might be able to fish it up here at G4 at these ponds as well. But I'm not 100% sure. But for fact, I have caught it here. And the effective lures are dog tag, rubber, poison, and white jelly lure. This fish is called the Neon Dory, and it is a saltwater rare fish. I've only found this on Olympus down here at A13 and B13 in the desert, the west of the desert here, where, well, pretty much where the water is. 
This is another one of those that where it says sticks. I don't, I can't find it anywhere in sticks, but it could very well be there. It does like dog tag lure, rubber, poison sack, and white jelly lure. This is the Neon Tetra, and it is a freshwater uncommon fish. This one's a toughie. This one I'm pretty sure that we caught either here at G14, almost positive is down here in the west part of the forest on Olympus. It's only caught on Olympus, but it also could very well be maybe over here in this pond at 011. If you're not catching it here at G14, check 011. This fish likes refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gores flour, cured leather, reed flour, yeast, and blue reed lures. This is the Oceanic Piranha, and it is a saltwater common fish. If it will show itself, there it is. So on Olympus, it's kind of easy to catch this one in the desert. So over here in the West Pond, pretty much, or any cave that has water in the desert, you'll be able to find this fish. Also, I do believe it's over in the canyons as well. So pretty much just canyons biome. Pretty much caught them around there everywhere. And over on sticks, basically this whole biome here. Uh, catch them in the, I think I caught them in the, the creeks right here. A little bit more effectively, but I think you can catch them in the pools of water as well. Dusty Barrens, anywhere that has cave, fish in a cave that has water. And just pretty much this whole entire biome. And this fish's favorite lure is the fiber and rotten meat lure. And you. This beautiful fish is the opal discus. And this is actually a freshwater rare fish. And this fish can only be found on Olympus. It is located here in the B3, B2 section of the Riverlands, up here up in the northwest section, right here at this single pool right here. And you can also find it on the Arkwood Outpost. And this fish's favorite lures are the dog tag, rubber, poison sack, and white jelly lure. This is the Opal Ripjaw, and he is a saltwater common fish. And ugly. And I've only found this guy on sticks and over here in the Dry Ridge area. This pond right here, and then I think maybe in over here I might have caught a small one. But I'm pretty sure over here in this, these ponds you can catch this fish. And this fish's favorite lures are the fiber and rotten meat lures. This is a opal trout, and he's perfect, 100%. He is a freshwater uncommon fish. So on Olympus, you're looking at finding the opal trout at B3 and B2, right here in this pond up the northwest side of the Riverlands. And up here in Styx, you're gonna be looking at the little lake right here at L4 in the Great River. You'll also find it up here at F1, F2 in the Grove biome. And we caught one down here at E14 as well in the Great River area. Down this very bottom lake. And this fish likes the refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flour, cured leather, reef flour, yeast, and blue reed lures. This fish is the Pearl Diano. And it is a freshwater rare fish. You can find this fish right here at 011. That's where I caught mine on Olympus. And I think you can also get it in the Holdfast Outpost. And over on sticks, basically any of the Arctic biomes, if you can find a cave with water in it and fish it there, you can find it. And at the top lake here in the Great River as well. And this fish's favorite lures are the dog tag, rubber, poison sack, and white jelly lures. And this is the pearl perch, and it is a uncommon freshwater fish. On Olympus, you can actually find these in, in any cave in the biomes, both of the biomes, the central arctic biome, and the southern glacier down here. 
You can also find them up in these north ponds up in the northeast side uh, there at M9, N10, and I, I believe also caught it at 08 as well. And I think pretty much anywhere else in the forest you can get pearl perch. But up here, I think you have a higher chance. You can also find it at the Ice Home Outpost as well. And this fish likes the refined wood, iron, advanced iron, doors flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. This is the sea darter, and this is a uncommon saltwater fish. This fish can be found only on sticks, and it is over here in Oasis and Barrens. Anywhere you can find an Oasis and Barrens. I think I found mine down here in the lower west on L14. This little pond right here. It looks like a little ring. Uh, I think that's where I found mine. And this fish really likes the refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast and blue reed lures this fish is the spotted perch and it is a freshwater uncommon fish on olympus you're going to find them in both of the central arctic and the southern glacier biome if you can find some water there i think you can also find it pretty much anywhere in the forest biome i have the most luck i think down here at g14 down here in the southwest part of the forest and also an ice home outpost as well and this fish is only caught on olympus with the refined wood iron advanced iron gorse flower cured leather reed flower yeast and blue reed lures this is one of the most familiar fish probably because it's the most common the spotted snapper it's a freshwater common fish on Olympus, you can find it in any of the Arctic biomes where you can find water in the Southern Glacier and Central Arctic biomes. You can also find it pretty much in any of the forest biome as well. And that includes all pretty much all the ponds as well. So it's pretty fairly common. Find it in the forest and in the both of the uh, Arctic biomes. And if you're ever on sticks, pretty much anywhere you can find water in any of the Arctic or forest biomes pretty much everywhere except for the desert you can find this fish so don't look in the deserts just all the arctic biomes and all the green biomes you see here and this fish's favorite lure is the fiber and rotten meat lure this fish is the spotted tetra and is an uncommon freshwater fish And I've only found this fish on one one pond, and it's 011 again, over here on the east side of the forest. And I'm pretty sure that's the only place I've found it so far. And this fish really likes refined wood lures, iron lures, advanced iron lures, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. And this fish is the spotted race, and it is a saltwater uncommon fish. Now on Olympus, I'm pretty sure you can only catch it up here in the canyons biome. Try searching in this pond right here at M4, and maybe try these ponds as well. And as far as sticks goes, I'm pretty sure only Dry Ridge, and I've caught mine up here at D5, D4 area in this pond right here. And this fish's favorite lures are the refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. And this fish is the sunset darter, and it's an uncommon saltwater fish. And the only sunset darters I found was on sticks, and it was down here at M12 and N13 again, down here in Oasis, right in the middle of the biome. This fish's favorite lures are refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed. This fish is the sunset jack, and it is a freshwater common fish. You can find it in both of the Olympus biomes that are Arctic, the Central Arctic and the Southern Glacier down here. 
pretty much anywhere in the forest biome and pretty much anywhere in the Riverlands biome as well. Uh, I think I found mine down in the south area where I live in the Riverlands. And this fish likes the fiber lure and the rot meat lure. This is the Sunset Ripjaw, and it is a saltwater common fish. And you can pretty much find this fish anywhere on the Styx Dry Ridge region. Pretty sure all these pools of water, you can find them there. That's where I found mine. This fish also likes the fiber lure and the rotten meat lure. This is the Sunset Trigger Fish, and it is a uncommon saltwater fish. And just like the Ripjaw, it is pretty much caught anywhere in the Dry Ridge region. Just check these lakes and you should find it. And only on sticks. And this fish loves refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flour, cured leather, reed flour, yeast, and blue reed lures. This is the Sunset Trout, and it is a freshwater uncommon fish. On Olympus, uh, you can pretty much find it anywhere, I think, in the Riverlands area. I usually find mine down here. Of course, this is really a really good fishing spot if you're using the fish finder. Around B5, C5, B6, this area right here. And you can also find this one on the Holdfast Outpost as well. And over here on Sticks, you can find it on the Ring Lake right here at 08. You can also find it in these two central ponds in the Great River at J7 and G7. And I think I found it in a creek or two down through here as well. Maybe just the Great River area in general. And this fish is fond of refined wood, iron, advanced iron, Gores flour, cured leather, reed flour, yeast, and blue reed lures. This is the Titan Dory, and it is a saltwater rare fish. And absolutely gorgeous. This one is a tough one as well. It's pretty much, I think I found mine around K7. For sure, you can find it right there for K7. I fished one or two of those out. You can also get them around M4 up here in the centralized ponds as well. Now, it does also say that this fish is caught on sticks, but I'd never seen it. But its favorite lures are the dog tag, rubber, poison sack, and white jelly lures. This fish is the Titan Piranha, and it is a common saltwater fish. This fish on Olympus is located, I found it right here at J2. So up in here at the Northwest Pond up north here. And over on Styx, I'm pretty sure you can catch it in either this river right here. I might have caught mine in the river or down here in this pond. I'm pretty sure it wasn't these two ponds right here, but this pond or this river. So check this area right here, L14, M14. And its favorite lures are the fiber lure and the rotten meat lure. This is the Titan Ripjaw, and it is a saltwater common fish. And purple and yellow. And this fish is also caught in the Dry Ridge region. I'm pretty sure anywhere in the west of the west north part of here, this biome at D4 and D5. And I think you can also catch it at G4 as well. But it's only available on sticks. The Titan Ripjaw's favorite lures are the Fiber Lure and the Rotten Meat Lure. This fish is the Titan Trigger Fish, and it's an uncommon saltwater fish. And you can actually find this one only on sticks in the oasis right here so before this wall right here anywhere in the oasis i think i found mine down west at l14 but i'm pretty sure you can fish uh any of these ponds and get it and it's a sticks only fish as you can see it loves the refined wood iron advanced iron forged flour cured leather reed flour and yeast and blue reed lure this is the Void Trigger Fish, and this is a uncommon saltwater fish. 
the only place I caught this was on sticks and right here at D4 and D5 at this lake right here. And this fish's favorite lures are the refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. And the last fish for us to show you is the void trout. And the void trout is this little black and purple fish. It is a freshwater uncommon. Now for us, Styx is the only place I've found this. And honestly, I've only found it here at 07 and 08, here at the Ring Crater Lake. You should also be able to find it since it's a freshwater in most of the Arctic biomes as well. So all these Arctic biomes also on Styx. This fish is said to be also on Olympus. This fish likes the refined wood, iron, advanced iron, gorse flower, cured leather, reed flower, yeast, and blue reed lures. I would say my most favorite fish on sticks, my top three, would be the void trigger fish, the crystal race, and the ghostly tank. And honestly, I couldn't pick a top three. I had to go with the top four. We're gonna call this the top three-ish for Olympus. It's gonna be the Pearl Diano, the Titan Dory, the Opal Discus, and the Titan Triggerfish. There's my last fish. Oh, Master Angler. So there we have it, everyone. We have all the fish. We're going to show you them all together as a collection. And they're not in any certain type of order. Just kind of in the order that I kind of caught them. But this is all the fish right here on Olympus that we caught for this video. And over on our sticks outpost, this is all the fish that we caught over here in this video as well. So all 53 fish guys caught and displayed for you guys. Hopefully that's at least worth a like in itself. And guys, that's it for this video. Don't forget if you like what you see to like the video, comment down below what fish you think looks the best in the game and subscribe to the channel. Subscribing to the channel will get you weekly Icarus update videos and content videos just like this one. I'm probably going to go throw this freaking pole into the lake and hopefully we'll see you next time. Peace. Goodbye. Oh, there's another one.